Hello, ladies and gentlemen. This is Ben with Eritabe Gardens. I have a nice one for you today. I wasn't prepared for what I'm about to show you guys. Today, earlier on today, I decided to go to my garden to see what's going on with the weather because the sun is very hot today so I went to the back of the house went to my garden and behold I saw some of the fig trees they've started waking up I said oh oh it is time to clean my garden it wasn't my plan to clean it but before you know it I started touching one thing or the other cleaning one thing or the other I ended up cleaning rearranging my fig garden let me show you guys what I did today Today is March 3rd. The weather is so nice. Warm. You know, it's a little bit hot. I just started cleaning my garden space for my figs. And I said, well, I can record the before and the after. You can see my um, what I put on the ground to cover the ground here are my fig trees in fact here is my pink lemonade blueberry already it has started this is just March 3rd so here are my figs so I'm going to clean it up, remove all these leaves, and I want you to see that, uh, look at, they've started opening up my feet, they've started opening up, so I walk as started in the garden, you see. They are getting ready to start producing leaves and then fig. So it's time for me to clean, remove all these leaves. You see, I left all these fig trees here throughout the winter. We had one or two snow. We have so many frost. But look at look at that one there is ready they are opening up gradually look at that one there You're getting ready so it is warming up it is warming up look at and this should be fruit, breba. This is my pira honey. This is my Adriatic. Look at that. They have started with fruit. Look at that. With breba. So I've got to clean. In this place before it to be too late look at that one there oh, see because the temperature is very very warm you see that the temperature is very very warm so I've got to clean this place get it ready for the fig season so I will show you guys after 
I'm done cleaning this place. Well, I've uh, removed the plastic tab. So I've removed all the leaves in the containers. You can see them. <clears throat> you know, I didn't plan to do any work in the garden today. I just came to see what is going on in the garden when I started seeing all this new growth. So I knew it is time to start cleaning the garden. I didn't plan. So now I'm going to rearrange the plastic top and then put the um, some varieties together like all of the LSU that I have I'm going to put them together all of the Texas ever bearing Texas blue giant Texas strawberry I'm going to put them together all of my different varieties of uh, brown turkey put them together various variety of uh, selects put them together my LSU gold put them together so that's what I'm going to do when I rearrange the uh, plastic tab yeah so uh, you guys will see it when I'm done ah oh, man I'm glad that I'm able to do this today I still have more taps at the back there's one tap there to put around there so I can add more containers uh, because I have some figs here that I need to up out to five gallons container all this here I see I have to clean here and then up put them to five gallon and right now I'm rooting more than 100 cuttings right now so I'll have to extend all these area here all these area close to my vegetable garden uh, the frost messed up my vegetable garden seriously but to my surprise my Brussels sprouts look at it. producing Brussels sprouts look at it. even though the frost didn't allow it to grow more even look at the broccoli too and look at my cabbage I have some cabbage head I don't know if they're going to grow big but now that we're entering spring you know I don't think that one is gone that cabbage is gone you know but uh, you know for the first time I opened my garden shade today for the first time in how many months now uh, you know but uh, this is the beginning of a garden walk again full force so I still have more work to do I still have to put more tabs around there around there so because I rearranged the tabs you can see where the tabs were before so now I'm going to put those tabs at the back there and in fact I overlay them too much so now I have so many taps you know when I when I um, upload those ones I have to upload when I upload them into five gallon containers I'll be able to put them here because I'm going to extend it to somewhere here with more taps 
all they are going to extend it you know so um, I'm happy that at least I've done this I didn't plan to do it but I did it that is what I did today without planning um, I still have more work to do um, those uh, big trees in those small pots I still have to upload them to five gallon pots I have some five gallon co uh, containers that I got for good deal two dollar per one uh, so I have to buy lot of potting mix or of soil a lot of uh, fertilizer slow release fertilizer uh soluble fertilizer but and right now i'm rooting more than 150 cuttings more than 150 cuttings i have them all over in this I have some right there rooting in water all over I'm telling you but I'm glad that uh, I got it done this is the beginning I'm excited that it's, uh, it's almost gardening season and uh, this year I have some new things I want to plant so you know it's going to be wonderful and I hope you start preparing for this year garden season it's going to be excited going to be wonderful a lot of new videos oh my goodness I have some videos in my sleeve that I would love to share with you guys at the right time some new discoveries <laughs> you know me I love experiment I love experimenting because experience is the best teacher thank you for watching this video with me if you like this video if if you are encouraged if you have been inspired to start cleaning your own garden too <laughs> please like this video and if you have not subscribed to my channel please subscribe to my channel click on the notification bell so that all the videos I have in my sleeve to produce to upload you won't miss any of them thank you so much and my subscribers I will always appreciate you guys thank you and I will see you in the next video.